All the guns in this video have been cleared and safety checked, so as far as you know, they're safe. Hey, this is DM Foss, and today's video is going to be a preview. Yeah, just a preview, sorry. Um, with all the China Wuha Fluazoa COVID 19 crap and the stay at home order, it kind of put everything I had planned um, on hold. And now I'm just starting to be able to get to some of it. Some of the stuff I had planned, I have to wait for my gun shop to open back up. So hopefully, before too long, I'll be able to get some more videos out. But um, upcoming, uh, I have a <coughs> Taurus Model 65 and 357 Magnum. Um, I put a few rounds through it, and I want to... Um, use it for a little bit longer before I do a review on it. So far I'm pretty happy with it. Um, good power, good balance, not too much kick. Uh, the one thing, the grips, I've got some wood grips that I ordered. These ones are just a hair thin for my hand and these will be just a little bit thicker. Make it a little more comfortable but I still need to get those installed, take it to the range, and then try it out. Um, so that'll be upcoming. Also, a Taurus TH9, and I got a 9mm, because I got tired of having to rent one when I took a new shooter to the range. Um, I've only put 50 rounds through it. So far, I'm kind of impressed. Uh, for sub-275, out the door, um, you get quite a bit for not too much money. But that's another upcoming one. Um, also, I just got a Blade Tech Next Belt um, for an EDC belt. When I bought the Model 65 Taurus, um, I got a 1791 holster and it's brown. My EDC belt is black. And you can't wear black with brown. So I got a brown belt and I'll try it out. I need to wear it for a while. Um, my core belt, which is my everyday belt, I love. So I'll use this as a baseline and compare this, the next belt, to the core belt. We'll see how it does. So far, I've worn it out a couple times um, out of the house and not too bad. Uh, just need a little more time with it and we'll see how I like it. Second part of this video is a video response to Todd the Gun Guy! He did a challenge where he broke down his EDC while blindfolded. Um, he didn't challenge me specifically, but I thought I'd give it a try. Uh, down in the description, there's a link to the original video and his channel. So I don't have a blindfold. I don't live the kinky lifestyle that maybe Todd the Gun Guy! Does. So I'm just going to use a mask as a blindfold and you'll have to take my word that I'm not cheating. So, nice thing about revolvers is to field strip them to clean them is that's all you have to do. Now is that cheating? That's for you to decide. Anyway, this is Dia. Todd the Gun Guy! Does it a lot better, so I'll leave that to him. Um, I just want to say, check out other channels if you get a chance. Um, find ones you've never watched. You might find content that you like. I think the best way we can protect our Second Amendment rights is to grow the community. So get out there, look around, see what you find, or start one yourself. Maybe people want to hear what you have to say. Well, have a good day.